This video is going to show how to install the Honda Trail Bikes Broker Crankshaft. Oh, look at this baby. It's a very nice looking part. It uh, comes with bearings and sprocket installed with the timing chain. It's got a nice polished connecting rod. Basically ready for you to drop in. That's what we're going to be doing. That's going to take my 88cc engine up to 108. Cool. Once you have the motor out of your bike, like so, you need to, uh, I'll remove the skip plate, I guess, but uh, remove the top end and remove the clutch. And then uh, once you've done that, keep watching this video. Alright, once you have your top end off, let me turn off this fan. Once you have your top end off and your clutch off, and the motor looks like this. Go ahead and split the cases. Um, all the stuff that I've done up to this point is shown in other videos I have. So hopefully you're uh, smart enough to look for them yourself. Um, yeah, so next step is to split the cases. Alright, I got all the bolts out on my case. I'm going to split it. Okay. A couple washers there. Don't lose them. See that one moving? Alright, let's uh, put this down right here. Get that little washer. All right, put that back with the long. Oops, here I'm in. All right, now, this is the most complicated part. This is the part where we actually install the stroker crankshaft. This is very complicated, all right? So I'm gonna put the camera down because this does require two hands. Are you ready? This is very difficult. This is the, this is the actual step of installing the, stroker, installing the stroker crankshaft. You ready? Okay now, that, looked, that was very exciting, but we're only halfway done. You ready? Oh my god. I just did it. Now I have my stroker crankshaft installed. That's it. That's all there is to it. That's the, the physical step of installing your stroker crankshaft. There's the old one. And uh, that's all there is to it. And uh, now you just bolt it all back together. So once you have your crankshaft in, it's just a matter of... Uh, hold on a second. Turn off my manual back here. Once you have your crankshaft installed, your, uh, your TB crankshaft... I can't read it anymore. Once you have your crankshaft installed, which has been so smooth, Anyway, once you have it installed, uh, it's just a matter of putting your uh, motor back together. Just throw them back on your top end. You can use the same piston. TV sells it with a new piston, which uh, you may want if your motor's been run for a while. Mine is pretty new anyway, so didn't bother. But yeah, once it's ready, just assemble it, and, uh, and we'll see how powerful it is. All right. Once you have your motor all buttoned up and installed with your new 51 millimeter stroker crankshaft totaling 108 cc's um, I guess you're ready to go bolt up your new carburetor I got a 24 millimeter Shangwei carb um, so let's see how it runs of course I already know how it runs so you'll see how it runs now mm -hmm, that's good yeah, I like 